Hey, yo, 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 Brooklyn in the house. This is Cruz, Cruz Chatter. And uh, we're gonna uh, talk about the uh, Carnival Vista, which is, which is still having uh, uh, speed problems. And uh, there was an email sent uh, to customers about the uh, uh, rescheduling. There's some uh, upcoming sailings that are going to be affected by these uh, changes in the uh, in their cruises. Um, six of them. The uh, 2022 departures, uh, October 15, October 29, November 12, are affected, as well as well as 2023 you know, on January 21st, February 4th, and the 18th. Um, they've been having to uh, uh, implement a work schedule to address an unexpected issue on Carnival Vista and will be conducting maintenance on the ship during their cruise, which means the ship will be unable to sustain the maximum cruising speed uh, required to operate your own uh, itinerary. So, each of the impactors, uh, impacted uh, 2022 cruises are seven night round trip cruises, uh, Western Caribbean from Galveston. The original schedules featured two day at sea, followed by visits to Montego Bay, Jamaica, Grand Cayman, and the Cayman Islands, and Cozumel, Mexico. The schedule was to conclude with another day at sea before arriving in Galveston. The 2023 departures are similar, with the ship following the same route, but visiting Falmouth, Jamaica, instead of Montego Bay. Now, all six have been change and will no longer call on either Grand Cayman or Jamaica. Instead, the ship will stay much further west, sub substituting Belize and Rotan Honduras as, as alternate uh, ports of call. The ship stay in Cozumel will also be lengthened. lengthened. The exact port times have been not, has not been announced nor have they any changes on the ship departures or arrival times to Galveston been indicated as of yet. And uh, there will be some compensation offer, which, uh, you know, they, that will be uh, taken care of by the uh, customer as they receive this email. Also, be mindful that there there is hurricanes coming around. There's, uh, we are in active uh, hurricane season and uh, there's one right now south of Jamaica making its way uh, towards Cuba to, to, towards the west side of Cuba and might come up towards uh, Florida and who knows from there uh, maybe the uh, uh, east coast will get some rain from this one uh, Fiona it's on, a, uh, you know, on its way towards uh, Bermuda and there's another storm north of Bermuda also which might hit uh, uh, you know going towards Canada so I guess just be aware of uh, all the changes that are happening uh, there's nothing we can do when it comes to hurricanes because it's mother nature so just keep an eye on your uh, cruises and uh, whatever upcoming news might come up and changes so you know you stay you stay alert for that and uh, uh, you know, hopefully everybody will get to do their cruises, even if we go to a different place. So, but just, just be safe. Remember, the cruise ships are not gonna go towards the hurricane. They're gonna stay away as much as possible. You know, it's their business. They're, they don't want to lose the ship or loss of life, and you know, why, why risk it? So, just be, just be glad that uh, they're doing the best to keep us safe. Also. So, also uh, tonight, 7 p.m., uh, Parker's on the go will be live. So, check him out. Uh, subscribe if you're not. And uh, so subscribe to this channel. And uh, keep me around, you know. I want to I wanna, I wanna be around, too. I'm, um, I'm enjoying what I'm doing. And, uh, you know, getting in touch with a lot of people, meeting new people. So, it, it's, it's been great. So, let's, let's see to see uh, what we can do. Also, uh, enjoy your day, you know, it's, at least where I'm at, it's sunny, nice. It's a good day to be to be alive, so be thankful. So take care, and uh, we'll 
talk to you soon. Chris Chatter, signing off. See you next time. Oh yeah.